Hi everyone, this is Lauren with Triple Seat. In this video, we're going to talk about how to optimize your venue listing on venues by Triple Seat, as well as your listing on EventUp. This is going to result in more leads and more business for your locations. Venues by Triple Seat and EventUp are both online directories for event planners or prospect customers to find the perfect venue for their next event. Included in your Triple Seat subscription is a listing on our Venues by Triple Seat directory, as well as on EventUp for all of your locations. So here is what the Venues by Triple Seat site looks like. And EventUp has a very similar layout. On both directories, guests can search the site by city and then browse all of the listings. When they click into a listing, they'll be able to see photos, read your venue description and offerings, and then they can add any venue that they're interested in to their quote cart. When the quote cart is submitted, this will come through as a new lead into Triple Seat for you to now manage. If you need to make any edits to either your Venues by Triple Seat listing or your Event Up listing, you will need to be a user with settings access. So on Triple Seat, you would come into settings and then you would scroll down and click on this Venues by Triple Seat option. On this page, you're going to see all of the locations on your Triple Seat account, and I can click Edit next to any of the listings that I need to. The most important thing that you can add to your listing is going to be photos. If you needed to add any, we would click this Edit and Add Photos, and then we would click Choose Files to upload from our desktop. When adding photos, we recommend a resolution of 1920 pixels wide. Images that are smaller than this are going to look blurry on the listing. We recommend only using photos that are high resolution and choosing photos that are shot in landscape mode as that is how they will appear on the listing. We also recommend using photos shot with natural light. If you're wondering what kind of photos should be added here, consider adding photos of your space set up for different event types, as well as adding photos of the different areas within your venue. Once a photo has been uploaded, we can click into it. You can give it a title or assign it an area so that your customer knows exactly what they're looking at when on your listing. After photos, you'll want to come in and review the description for your listing. It can be pretty tempting to just copy and paste the blurb from your website into this description but try to elaborate a little bit more. Here you can really paint a picture of how great an event at your location would be. You wanna to try to highlight anything that sets your venues apart from others. So maybe we want to highlight our fantastic view or maybe an Instagram worthy space where guests can take great pictures. Below the description, you want to check off all that would apply to your venue, like the type of events that you take, cuisine styles offered, amenities that you have, your price range, all of these will help your venue listing stick out when your customer is filtering their search through the directories. At the bottom of the page here, you can detail out each of the individual areas within your space. You can also list the sitting and standing capacities for each area. Our best practices are to update your listing every six months to ensure the most up-to-date information is included for your guests. Once we have updated, we'll go to the bottom and click update. And the great news is whenever you update your venue listing in your triple seat settings, automatically this information is pushed to both your venues by triple seat directory and a listing on event up. So the listing is now in two different places and we just had to make that update in one area. If you want to see what those updates look like, click this preview button. And now we're looking at the live venue listing. You can browse through and see how those photos are showing. Your customers will be able to read up on that description, see those amenities, event types, and everything else you just filled out. They can see your location on Google Maps, and then they can read up a little bit more about these spaces. If you want to increase traffic to your venues by Triple Seat or event up listings, we offer some premium listing subscription options. The first would be a premium listing, which is going to highlight your venue with a rotating listing of the venue at the top of the page, regardless of any filters that have been set by the guest. 
you will also get a spotlight blog post written about your venue by our blog team. The second option would be Premium Plus, which adds the additional benefits of appearing in other local search results and allows you to define competitors that you want to target so that your listing will appear alongside theirs. If you wanted to subscribe to one of these plans, just go into your triple seat settings. All the way at the bottom right, you're going to see triple seat advanced features and subscriptions, and you would select add a subscription. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions at all, please reach out to our support team, support at triple seat.com, or by clicking on the help question button on the top right corner of any screen in triple seat.